Fall and Vets. And what city is this happening in? Uh, Milford, uh, Milford, um, uh, Michigan. And it's uh, the What's battlefield. What's the problem with this? Well, the Battlefield Cross, they want to do this to punctuate and really be the centerpiece of this uh, of this display for the military and salute to the military. And this is a great idea. The guy's actually doing it has the best name I've ever heard, Bear Hall. He's also a veteran. Sounds good. Kit Bond, my favorite name of all. That is probably good. Brian Kilney, like distant third, I understand, but Arthur Idell wants to say something about that. So this is a great move, but they say, wait a second. I love the veterans, but I don't think it's good to have a gun in a park. What's up with a gun in the Vets Memorial? Yeah, how dare you have a gun? Well, I just thought, as far as I could tell, judging by the video I've seen, thanks to uh, Oliver North's War Stories, you win wars with guns. Oh, is that right? This is the way they do it, to salute in the field. To me, this would be very powerful. It might strike up a conversation with family to say, you know, son, daughter, let me tell you how we won this war and what these people sacrificed for this war. And now they find it too too alarming, yeah. which leads me to my next topic, because my new M animation, this is going to be the name of my book someday, it's that story and this one. Go ahead, roll it. <laughs> Cupcake Nation. That's what we're turning into. That's mine, just so you know. And and.